that was quite an entrance, Wally. I mean, music and all. I, I, I didn't get a chance, actually, to say that it is, in fact, Molly Sugden, of course. This is Slocum from Are You Being Served. Now, listen, my love, the band is clearly going to go on and on and on right through the interview. It seems a little bit silly. What we can do, at least for this part of the show, is wander up there because we've got another studio and we can be, we can be shut off from the sound and continue there, if that's okay with you. Yes, is that all right? All Let's wander up. I see you didn't bring your moggy tonight. Oh, no, my poor pussy. I, I, I used to wonder whether we'd ever get to see Mrs. Slocum's cat. Oh. And in fact, it eventually appeared, but yes. it wasn't a real one. Uh, no, not really. Uh, we did try to have one once, but as soon as the lift doors opened and they saw me there holding the cat, they all went mad and cried and laughed. And of course, the cat ran away. <laughs> <laughs> well, you, you seem to have a rather bad experience with cats because didn't you once you had a live cat on some television commercial you made over in Australia? Oh, yes, yes. I had a green wig on and they wanted the cat to be green. So they dyed it with vegetable dye. But unfortunately, they did it the night before, you see. And during the night, it licked itself clean. <laughs> and next morning, we had a white cat with a bright green tongue. <laughs> <laughs> How long? You know, when Are You Being Served first came out, and I think I'm right in saying that it didn't really get the public acclaim that, that, that later came about. I mean, no. why, why was that? Well, because, I think... Because the jokes, I think, were fairly obvious. No, you, if you, you'd like to sit down here, Molly? Yes. Sorry about this. I mean, uh, no, we, we, not we at might all. get back to the other studio later on, but uh, for the moment, let's stay. Uh, oh, yeah. it's quite cosy in there, is, isn't it? Is it? Is it, is it, <laughs> <laughs> yes, it's a bit quiet because the audience are sitting so far away. But, uh, yes. No, no but, but, but going back, I mean, why, why didn't it take off initially? Well, I think we had very strong opposition at the beginning for an unknown show, you see. Uh, uh, the first six we played with Coronation Street at the other side, which, of course, was an established favourite. And then the next six, for I think about four of them, we had Man About the House in opposition, which yeah. was another established favourite. And it wasn't until we had a documentary or a sort of news programme that everybody quickly switched the knob and said, oh, look at this! And we were off. Yeah. But it did take quite a time. 